And a steal by Bryant. Gives it off to Beal. Back to Bryant. We've got contact. It's going to be an offensive foul called. Here is probably throwing it up to the rim to Thomas Bryant, or maybe even taking it all the way yourself. But you're always taught never to put your center or your big man in that position while they're running the floor for somebody to step up and take a charge right there. Seen as slow starts for the Wizards in this preseason. Beal, his pull-up jumper is long. Hatchamore, the offensive rebound. Gets it blocked. It's out of bounds. Will stay Wizards ball. Great offensive rebound by Rui. Doing, doing the little things. He's never, uh, he's never out of a play, it seems like. Even if he doesn't have the ball, the play's not called for him. He does a great job of second effort plays, third effort plays, primarily on the offensive glass. Being uncomfortable uh, shooting from long range and guys just sagging off on him. And I always said if Giannis turns into a, a decent three point shooter, I mean, his averages from 27 goes to 35 like that. Hill a deep three. And Hachimura gets the rebound. Went up high for that. Beal picked up by Lopez, and good job finding the mismatch down low. Tom the fact that you've got a big man that can run the floor. Yeah. Beal gets the block right there. Here's Hachimura. Euro step through, drew the contact against Ilyasova, and he will head to the free throw line. Smart. He is a heady rookie. I mean, check out his, his IQ. Just already adjusting, knowing that Ursan wanted to take the charge a couple possessions before that, and now trying to sidestep Ursan Ilyasova, who's one of the best guys in our league at taking charges. And Rui adjusted it on the fly. Times already this preseason. Yeah, yeah but see, the first time mm -hmm. Ursan tried to take the charge, it was a no call. Rui pick on, picked up on that like a, a true vet, not a rookie, but a vet and sidestepped him. And it, it was a play against the Knicks the first game where he went left and Mitchell Robinson blocked the shot. Then he came back three possessions later and dunked it with the left hand. Like he had just on the fly. He was more than just ragu. He was... Bertans. Corner three. Hatchamora. 17-13. Wizards trail here in the first. Great find to find a rookie in the corner. Let's see how the second group gets. Hachimura to the hoop. Able to hang, but they're going to say offensive foul. Using the off arm to shield the defender. Oh, man. Now, did you see what I, you know, what I saw right there? A little Scotty Pippen that was in my scouting report. I didn't realize how large... Rui's hands are and I mean he's gripping that ball every time he attacks the basket so even if he gets fouled he still has enough control to finish at the basket by the way I was wrong flagrant one yeah I mean it's, it's, you know it, this is preseason uh, Isaac Banga and Mo Wagner to be a part of this Washington Wizards team how about this right here Hachimura the alley-oop pass wasn't the best, able to get the rebound and then find Bryant open underneath. Because you play in the big game, which is the all-star game, two times in a row, you get a big red X on your back and an asterisk in every scout report. Hachimura finds Beal, unable to hit this time. In his days in San Antonio, he's very familiar with George Hill and what he's capable of doing for his basketball team. Hachimura, the offensive rebound, he gets fouled again. I mean, every rookie, I mean, if you look at the, the numbers historically on rookies shooting free throws, I mean, my rookie year, I was about 60%, 67% from the line, and that dramatically increased over a, a summer. Three, short, taps it to Hachimura, gets it blocked, puts it back, can't finish, there's Beal, that goes in. Wow, just relentless on the glass and it starts with Rui the rookie keeping it alive for two offensive rebounds for Brad to come up and follow it up and now Hachimura able to get the hand on it Beal finding it for the finish reward the rook can I say Rui Sirachimura no <laughs> <laughs> I like it I like it I think I'm on to something Hachimura with the rebound 
Rui. He gets called for steps. Mora. Let's look at it. Getting up in the passing lanes, deflections, great things happen, running the floor, even better. The stuff by Rui Sarachamara. I like it, I like it, I like it. You're flying solo on that. <laughs> <laughs> Lost siblings. Good looking guy. Middleton against Wagner. Wagner got a piece of it. Hachimura's got it up ahead to Booth. Leads it back for Rui. And Matthews thought he picked Rui's pocket. Instead, it's a foul and two free throws coming up for Hachimura. You know, Chris mentioned about the starters and what happened when they come back. You know what? This group is setting the tone right now and kind of setting the standard on how to play hard, how to move the ball offensively and playing unselfish. And also, some misses. Be interesting to see who's winning all those shooting games. Booth trying to find Hachimura in the paint. Hachimura, strong finish. Just his third field goal of the night. It's for three-point baskets, and now you're already down three points as a Washington Wizards. Another runner by Booth, tipped by Hachimura. The follow. There's the hustle by Rui Hachimura. Go, go, gadget arms. You knock that three down. Might be a timeout. Rui Hachimura, he's got himself a double-double. 10 points, 12 rebounds. Look at the effort on the offensive glass. Just not giving up, Justin. Look at it. Tip in right there. So what? I'll go right back up. I got a second jump, too. And it's interesting to see how many guys are actually blessed with that, that second jump. You know, Sean Marion had it. A guy by the name of Drew Gooden had it. A guy by the name of Zion Williamson has it. <laughs> Phil Booth over him.